sleep on the job again, you're out. Out? Out! Understand? Now clean up this tent. I want everything stick and span before the first show.
officer. Hurry! What's the trouble, museum person? One of my bones is missing. You don't want a cop, mister. You want a doctor. It's not my bone that's missing. It's the priceless toe bone of this priceless dinosaur. Where's it missing from? Right here. The toe bone's connected to the foot bone. Why, George, he's right. And the foot bone's connected to the heel bone. And the heel bone's connected to the shin bone. And the shin bone's connected to the knee bone. Now, cut that out. Anybody else in the building? No, just me and the bones. No likely suspects? Wait a minute. There's those two cleanup guys. Tom and Jerry! is worth a fortune. You two were the last ones near it, and your fingerprints are all over everything. So, if you don't want to be sent up for the rest of your unnatural lives, find that bone! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, my name is Black Barney. 
Talking with Jay Grab Freely, the man who captured a live woolly mammoth, which was thawed out of the frozen Arctic wastelands of Alaska. Glad you could come, Mr. Freely. Glad to be here for the frozen Arctic wastelands of Alaska. Where can we see this beast? He's at the Jay Grab Freely Sideshow. Admission five dollars. But I brought a picture of a mammoth so the TV audience can see what this living fossil looks like. Now here's a special announcement. 
The woolly mammoth has just escaped from its cave. The fierce beast is at large in the city. The police force and the ASPCA are on full alert. This ferocious prehistoric mammal was last seen in the vicinity of Elm and Walnut Streets. <laughs> Alaska Star leaves Pier 6 for Alaska tonight. Oh, gee, that's well. Will you take me to the ship? <laughs> We're looking for ferocious runaway mammoth. Any idea where he might be? That away? Oh, oh, just as I thought. Thank you, sir. You've been very helpful. I'm hungry. One banana. That'll be five cents. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm sure gonna miss you. as Tom prepares to serve his famous cannonball shot. The next event will be the fall ball. And Jerry has asked the officials to raise the bar to 50 feet. If he clears the bar, he'll beat Tom's record. <laughs> he did it! This is going to be a tough one for Tom to talk today. Kung Fu is a first for an event of this kind, and Tom and Jerry, both masters of the martial art, should make this an exciting contest. Jerry wins the cuddle pool. And now for the big, the hundred yard dash. Tom needs this one to catch up with Jerry. <laughs> Jerry limbers up, and there's the signal to take their places. On your mark, get set. <laughs> and Jerry wins in ten seconds flat. <laughs> And here's real excitement. The 200 meter freestyle race between our evenly matched contestants. Tom 
definitely has the advantage in the weightlifting contest, and Jerry is going to be hard pressed to win. <laughs> 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 And now, ah, what confidence, what boy, what owl. What a disaster. Jerry is set for the running broad jump, but a lot depends on this one. And here he goes. The distance covered measures 14 inches. <laughs> Tom approaches the starting line, limbers up, and he's ready to go. Tom is really picking up speed. This could be a new world record. It's the 18th hole, the score is tied, and Jerry is about to tee off. It's a great drive! The ball is on the green and rolls to a stop inches away from the cup. A beautiful shot. This is an important shot for Tom. Can he make it? A great shot! And Jerry wins the match. The discus throw is the final match of the day. And it's Tom's only chance to tie the score, or he'll lose the match. Jerry gets set. The roll! <laughs> well, it looks like the match will end in a tie. Tom should have no trouble beating Jerry's distance of 11 inches. <laughs> And now for the wrap-up in sport. Although the decathlon should have ended hours ago, Tom has not yet completed the last event, and there's no telling when he will. This is your favorite sports station signing off. Good night, Jerry. Good night, Tom.
remember the National Bowl Off. The alleys are packed, and an eager crowd of sports fans are gathered to await the arrival of the finalists, Tom and Jerry. And here they are! <laughs> Throughout the tournament, Tom has been supremely confident, and tonight is no exception. On the other hand, Jerry has been the undermount, but has come on doggedly to reach the final. <laughs> This championship bowl off is ready to start, and Jerry will lead off. Jerry puts the pressure on Tom by leading off with a strike. And now, Tom is the picture of concentration as he prepares to bowl. to make the 7-10 split. Tom has changed balls for this difficult shot. What a spectacular shot! Tom picked up his spare and saved himself from an open frame. Now Jerry gets prepared to roll. He's looking for his bowling ball. Well, what a good sport Tom is! He brought Jerry his bowling ball. <laughs> Jerry gets set and makes his delivery. <laughs> wow, Jerry's hot tonight. He gets another strike and keeps the pressure on top. right back with a solid strike. Pin setter to place the pins. And it's another big strike for Jerry. The pressure is on Tom again, and he really needs a strike to stay in the game. Oh, what a tough break! It looks like Tom has rolled a gutter ball. Always the good sport. Tom is wiping the alley for Jerry. What? Tom is even wiping Jerry's bowling ball for him. Now Tom hands Jerry the ball. And Jerry throws. <laughs> oh, top break for Jerry, missing his strike. And now he must get all ten pins to make a spare. Wow, what a solid hit as Jerry picks up his spare. <laughs> his bowling ball, and now he approaches the lane confidently. Wow! This is a real trick shot! Oh, my God. 
the last ball for Jerry. If he rolls a strike, he wins the ball off. <laughs> It's a strike! Jerry wins the ball off! Congratulations, champ! And here's your trophy, Jerry. You earned it! <laughs> People know you can't catch fish if you're noisy. Now cut that, Thank <laughs> you. 
Seated Tom and number two seated Jerry. Before the singles finals, we will have a mixed doubles exhibition game. And while the stands are filling, Jerry is warming up. and we're ready for the next doubles match. Jerry's partner is Ivan Jagalov. And Tom's partner is Big Bertha. Jerry and Ivan have the serve, and Jerry will serve to Tom. Tom returns the serve, and Ivan misses. But Jerry lobs it back over Big Bertha's head. Hi, Jerry! Hi, Jerry! What a smash as Big Brother returns the ball. Stop 15, and now Jerry will serve to Big Bertha. Sizzling return by Big Bertha. Love 30, and now Jerry serves to Tom. And rushes the next. Tom returns the serve, and he rushes the next. 
What a volley! Carl cherry hits into the net, and the score is love 40. This will be match point as Jerry serves to Big Bertha. Big Bertha smashes Jerry's serve. He found gets a racket in front of the smash and drops it back over the net. Tom's playing with it under Yvonne's return. Great shot! Tom knocked it over Yvonne's head. Big Bertha's running back, gets left, and delivers a devastating smash. Match point. Tom and Big Bertha win the mixed double. Tom and Big Bertha are running to shake hands with the losers. As soon as Tom and Jerry are ready, we'll have the singles championship match. And now, the championship singles match. Jerry is awaiting Tom's serve. What a smash! There's no way Jerry could return that serve. Fifteen love. And now, Tom's picking up a ball for his next serve. Jerry's all set. Tom drops his serve just over the net. 30 love. Tom serves again. Jerry returns it with a high love. Tom running back. He doesn't know if it's going to be in or out. Out! 40 love. This could be the end point. Jerry returns the serve. Tom puts a terrific backspin on the ball. It's going to drop over the net. Tom wins the first game easily. When the match resumes, Jerry will be serving to Tom. Now Jerry's ready to serve. Double ball, not fifteen. Jerry's having trouble with his serve. Now he's trying an unorthodox serve. Jerry's point, fifteen all. Jerry chooses a new rack. Tom gives Jerry the ball. And play will be due. Four. Jerry forgot to release the ball. Double four. Tom's point. <laughs> Jerry's ready to serve again.
My, I do declare my little heart goes boom, boom When I see a fine skier like you perform Would you all show poor little old me a few pointers? <laughs> Oh, 
But you know she'll fall in love with me if you point it. Hmm. I'm just a fall in love with Snow Bunny, you know. sleep on the job again, you're out. Out? Out! Understand? Now clean up this tent. I want everything stick and span before the first show.
What's the hurry? What's the trouble, museum person? One of my bones is missing. You don't want a cop, mister. You want a doctor. It's not my bone that's missing. It's the priceless toe bone of this priceless dinosaur. Where's it missing from? Right here. The toe bone's connected to the foot bone. Why, George, he's right. And the foot bone's connected to the heel bone. And the heel bone's connected to the shin bone. And the shin bone's connected to the knee bone. Now cut that out. Anybody else in the building? No, just me and the bones. No likely suspects? Wait a minute. There's those two cleanup guys. Tom and Jerry! is worth a fortune. You two were the last ones near it, and your fingerprints are all over everything. So, if you don't want to be sent up for the rest of your unnatural lives, find that bone! I'm <laughs> 
Yes? Uh, what's that? Oh, you must mean the missing dinosaur bone. Well, that's back, you know. I had it sent out to be cleaned and forgot all about it. <laughs> No, 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 don't do that. Don't, don't, don't fall. I'll, I'll save you. Oh, fire. Let me see that 
leather shoe rack. Well, I'll be horn swaddled. It's the map to the Lucky Dutchman gold mine. Which one of you two mangy, sidewinding desert rats says it's his map? Well, it's Black Barney's now. And just so you don't get any funny ideas, I'm putting it in a nice, safe place. If you help me dig up the gold, you'll get yours. And if you don't help me, you'll get yours. <laughs> to <laughs> volunteer to dig up my gold.